Good afternoon. It is about 12.30 on the 23rd of August. It's a Tuesday, and I'm about to go to lunch with my mom. All my friends at Baylor started school yesterday. I did not, uh, so I sat around on Sunday night, and yesterday being all depressed because I don't want to go back to school. And there's something about it, I don't know what it is, but every semester I just never want to go back to school. And it takes me like three weeks to get back into being comfortable. So I always doubt myself and I get there and I always say that I want to transfer and that I don't like it. And it's just this whole big deal, which is not fun. But this year I'm living with a friend. Our sweet mates are cool dudes, so that should be really good. It should be a lot better than my living situations in the past. And um, I'm in a building with a lot of friends. Last year it was just like me and my roommate and our sweet mates were the only people that I knew really. Um, I knew the guys who lived above us, but we don't really like talk or anything. So this year should be better from a living standpoint. But Still not really looking forward to it, but you know, we'll see. So my mom and I are hanging out today, kind of get my mind off of things. A really good lunch in before I go back on Saturday. I leave on Saturday. So it's coming up quick and then right into school. And it's going to be it's gonna be great, I think, maybe. I don't know. I just finished school like a week and a half ago, so I'm not really ready to go back, but we'll make it work. Just got back from lunch at a place called Offsite Kitchen. If you're from Dallas and you've never been there, go to Offsite Kitchen. Really good. It's like burgers and sandwiches. They have like fountain drinks that are like 15 different types of soda. I had black cherry. It was really good. But had some fun downtown, driving around, looking at the buildings. It was really cool. Um, my mom, I found out, listens to like hits one uh top 40 stuff like that she was jamming out to some gwen stefani in the car she just like turned on the radio and that's what was on it was pretty fun but i am just gonna kind of hang out today i think i might go to the mall uh go look at some shirts and some shoes my mom was giving me crap because she said that it's like i get new shoes every six weeks but i've had my tennis shoes for a year and they're starting to uh, kind of die on me, like, right here, the seam is starting to bust, there's like no traction left on them at all, because I wear them all the time, so, uh, gonna see if I can get any good deals on that type of stuff, finish line, you know, Nike, Nordstrom's, so we'll see. On my way to the mall, and y'all, I'm struggling, the weather stripping on the, the back hatch of my car, leaks and we've had a lot of rain recently and my car smells so bad i have no idea how to deal with it but it smells like something is slowly okay bmw you're gonna cut me off uh it smells like something dying mixed with like water and grass it smells so bad help these are some of the houses, like, five minutes away from my house. And this is a really, really nice neighborhood. And I really want to live here one day. It's going to take a lot of work. But I, 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 maybe I could do it. I don't know. Maybe. There's like ten houses in this neighborhood that have freaking water fountains in their driveway. It's ridiculous. It's absolutely ridiculous. Like, who has this much money? It doesn't make sense. That one's not that big. But, like, look, look at that. It's a freaking water fountain. Oh my gosh. It's crazy. Just got back, and all I bought was a shirt. I walked around the mall like two or three times, went into the same stores a couple of times each, and didn't end up buying anything other than a shirt from Urban Outfitters. I need need shoes minor like i was telling you earlier they kind of busted up but they still work so i can hang on to them for a while but so i went into the nike store and tried on some shoes i went into finish line three times and nobody helped me any of the times that i was there so i left and went to the nike store i'm out of breath because i just walked up a flight of stairs 
because um, I'm out of shape. But there's also a woman right behind me uh, getting into her car, and I don't want her to see me vlogging because that's always kind of uncomfortable for people to look at. So, I turn to the side. But yeah, uh, Nike helped me out, tried on some shoes. Now I'm going to go home and talk to my mom. Try to talk her into it, look online. Because if she's going to pay for them, that'll be great. If not, I'll pay for them, but I don't really want to because shoes are expensive when you're an adult. But, okay, now she's leaving. But yeah, walked around the mall a couple times. Only bought a shirt. It's my life right now. It's pretty cool. 1015. Uh, I didn't really do anything for the rest of the day. I played some video games. Uh, we had really good dinner. Uh, my mom made me a mocha with her little, like, Nespresso thing. That was really good. I enjoyed that. Thanks, Mom. Um, but yeah, just kind of been hanging out. My sister was ranting about how, um, the people who design websites for, like, dress companies, she's looking for a homecoming dress for her boyfriend's homecoming dance. Um, she's complaining about how the people who design them do a very bad job. And I was very mad about that for some reason. I don't get it. But that's all I've been doing today. Um, so I'm going to finish up getting ready for bed. And then I'm going to edit this. And then I'll post it later. So I'll see all y'all later.